Welcome to the Anti-Cruelty Society's How to Make a Dog Tug Toy video. For these sturdy, easy to make toys, all you'll need is an old t-shirt, scissors, and a little patience. Making one of these toys is a simple way you can positively impact the life of a dog during their stay at our shelter. Let's get started. We begin by cutting off the top of the t-shirt just underneath the armpits. Then we proceed to cut off the bottom hen. Take the remaining section and cut it into four equal pieces. Cut each strip along the fold so that you have four long strips in total. You'll notice we're using strips of different colors to make it easier to braid. Take the end of each strip, hold them together, and tie them in a knot, pulling as tight as you can. Take the knotted end and hold it firmly between your knees to keep it steady as you begin braiding. Spread out your strips in a cross pattern. Let's label them one, two, three, and four. Start with the strip closest to you, strip number one, and drape it across the top of strip number two. Then take strip number two and drape it across the top of strip number three. And finally, drape strip three across the top of four. Then take strip number four and tuck it through the loop created by strip one. You'll gently pull on the strips, alternating across all sides. And this is what's gonna give it a nice square shape. Tighten the strips until they are snug and you've officially created your first box braid. Now, repeat your braiding. Strip one draped over two, two draped over three, three draped over four, and four tuck through the loop created by one. Gently pull the strips again, maintaining the square shape and tighten. The tighter you make your stitches, the longer it'll last for the dogs. Now, one more time, and you should see the beginnings of a box braid pattern. You'll want to leave enough material at the end of the braid so you can finish it with a knot. Take the four strips and knot them together like so, pulling as hard as you can to ensure the longevity of the toy. Snip off the remaining fabric, leaving a bit so the knot doesn't come undone, and voila! You have now completed a tug toy that you can donate to one of the dogs in our care. Thank you!